Good day everyone, this is Teacher Nori. In this video, we are going to talk about the effects of force on objects. What are the effects of force on objects? The effects of force on objects are, it can make a stationary object move, it can make a moving object stop, it can change the direction an object is moving, or it can change the appearance of an object. How can force change motion? Force can make changes in an object's motion or direction when unbalanced forces act on it. What are balanced and unbalanced forces? Balanced forces are forces acting on a body in opposite directions but are equal in strength. It does not affect the motion of objects, but it can change the shape of an object. Unbalanced forces are an equal amount of forces acting on a body. It can make an object change its motion or change its direction of motion. For example, in a tug of war, if one group exerts more effort or more force on the rope, then that group will be able to pull towards it the other group. For birds that are diving, uh, the air resistance is lesser than the force of the bird going down. And this will only make the dive of the bird slower, but it will still reach ground. Here are examples of unbalanced forces. In the first two sets of arrows, it shows us that if two forces are acting on an object with different values and on in opposite directions, the motion of the object can be determined by the greater force. So the direction in which the greater force is going will be the motion of the object. And then the value of force that will act on the object or that will make the object move is going to be the difference between the two forces that acts on it. If forces are in the same direction, we simply need to add the value of the forces to determine the amount of force acting on the object. Of course, the direction of motion will be the direction of the forces given. For a skydiver, the pull of earth or gravity plus its weight will determine how fast it can reach uh, the ground. But if we take into consideration air resistance, which is also called as drag, this one can prolong the dive and make, it, uh, make the dive longer. Here are other examples of unbalanced forces. Can you tell which direction the ball will go in this picture? How about in this picture? What will happen to the ball? And in this picture, what do you think will happen to the ball when thrown away? And that is the end of our video. Thank you for watching. Until next time.